Hello friends, welcome to my video. In this video, we are going to see the difference between enrichment media and selective media. At first, we are going to see about the enrichment media. Let's see the meaning of the term enrichment. Enrichment means the act or process of improving the quality or power of something by adding something else. We learned the meaning of the term enrichment. Now let's see what is enrichment media. Enrichment media. An enrichment medium contains some component that permits the growth of specific types or species of bacteria. Because these specific organisms alone can utilize the component from that medium. This explains why we named this medium as a enrichment medium because we are adding some components that permits the growth of specific types or species of bacteria. That means we are improving or powering or supporting the growth of bacteria by adding some components to the medium. For better understanding, we'll see one example. In mixed cultures, the bacteria to be isolated is often overgrown by the unwanted bacteria. Unwanted means non-pathogenic or common cell bacteria. For example, if we want to isolate Salmonella typhi from feces, Salmonella typhi being overgrown by S. ratio coli in cultures from feces. In such situation, substances which support the growth of bacteria to be isolated or substances with an inhibitory effect on those unwanted bacteria are incorporated in the medium. The important point to be noted here is that by using this medium, we are actually improving the power of bacteria by adding some substances which support the growth of bacteria to be isolated or substances with an inhibitory effect on those unwanted bacteria. So, we are using the term enrichment media. Example, tetrathionate broth where the tetrathionate inhibits coliforms while allowing typhoid and paratyphoid bacilli to grow. Another example is selenite F broth. Enrichment medium is a liquid medium. We are using the enrichment media before culturing in order to increase the number of the organisms to be isolated and eliminate the unwanted organisms. Next we are going to see about selective medium. If you are able to understand what is enrichment medium, then it is easy for you to understand what is selective medium. Let's see what is selective medium. If the inhibiting substance or enhancing substance is added to a solid medium, then it is known as selective medium. While explaining what is enrichment medium, I told you enrichment medium is a liquid medium. If we add solidifying agent to that liquid medium, then we will be calling it as a selective medium. So, selective medium is a agar based medium which supports the growth of specific or selected organisms by restricting the growth of other unwanted organisms. The selectivity of the medium depends on the addition of antibiotic agent, chemicals, indicator dyes and media with altered pH. Example, deoxycholate citrate medium for dysentery bacilli. I am concluding this video here and see you soon in my next video. Thank you friends.